did not do it alone. Best of luck. At this time, it is my pleasure to introduce the commencement speakers who have been chosen to speak to us today on the theme, What Lies Before Us. Our first speaker is Kathy Sue Holtorf, daughter of Scott and Deborah Holtorf. Odd. I never noticed a rabbit hole here before. Very curious. Rabbit hole. Enter here. Well, I'm not exactly a rabbit. Down Alice goes, down into Wonderland, down the seemingly endless black tunnel, chasing after desire, paradoxically both fearless and terrified. A mirror reflecting her image of herself, falls past her at a speed more rapid than her own. Remind anyone of high school? Many times our own reflections of ourselves along with our reputations for Sita, and we foolishly spend time trying to catch up to that image. And we lose the exhilarating feeling of our stomach up near our throats from falling down that tunnel. High school may have felt like an endless black tunnel to some, while others may consider the past four years the greatest thrill of their life. Throughout the journey, like Alice, we become lost, navigating the unfamiliar and trying to find our own individual identity in a sea of strange and sometimes sad occurrences, unusual characters and mixed messages that need to be deciphered. We've all cried. We've all tried to get out of sticky situations. And now, as we're about to exit the tunnel, we may shed more tears. We may hesitate. And luckily, our chosen guides and confidants will help us along the way. Like the mouse, a teacher who speaks quietly, but you know always has something important to say. And that dodo bird we all call our best friend. Most of all, Grinning from afar like the Cheshire cat are our family who whisper the secrets of how to get through the maze of Wonderland. Alice would not have fallen down that tunnel without a sense of wonderment. Without curiosity, she would not have discovered such a beautiful place where the questions are more important than the answers. And without jumping, she would not have made such amazing friends. Alice's journey is a mythical one. Ours is a literal one. But like this curious girl, we push forward, forgetting our fears. What lies before us is what lies within us. Someone once said to me that there is always a little man inside your head trying to teach you logic. Then there is a child inside your heart, trying to help you smile, trying to help you laugh, trying to help you love. In today's world, many voices try to persuade us to forget about that child, that child that helped Alice discover Wonderland. Right here, in your heart, is where you will derive your passion to Right here, in your heart, is where you will teach your own children how to love. And right here, in your heart, is where you will lock up the memories of these past four years and hold on to them forever. Never forget that happiness is not found in the material things we possess, but in what lies within. After graduation, when we've hit the end of the tunnel and we're about to enter into the real world, we may never see each other again. But that child inside 
holds the key that will allow us to return to this place and this feeling. Remember those who have made you smile. Remember that and share that joy with the rest of the world. What lies before us is all up to us. Class of 2005, get ready for a new journey.